Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna have some destroyer gameplay in BGs. So we're gonna be fighting like I think uh, seven or six of uh, different defenders and we are starting from an ascended weapon X right here. This is rank 5 C200 weapon X and the reason I think uh, destroyer is really good for weapon X is because you know when weapon X in, is in his uh, what, what's that berserk phase I think it's called He's really aggressive and it's really easy to do intercepts with Destroyer and if you do those intercepts, she's gonna build up your charges a lot faster. As you can see, I'm gonna build up those Furies without even having to throw too many SP once. I think at this point I'm gonna do two and more intercepts, maybe I throw a special one, I'm not too sure. No, I think I'm gonna do, uh, yeah, a heavier here just to refresh my Furies. And then I just gotta do an intercept, pop that special two, and then yeah, we just got at least two more special tools ready if we need all of them there we go look at that we're so close to the next one and yeah at this point i can even throw it because the beams are would be unblockable even if you block that even if you didn't die from that uh the last few hits are unblockable so that was a almost 50k score 60 seconds 100 percent health not too bad so this is actually going to be one of my favorites i didn't want to do this on stream because i didn't know if it's going to work but here, this is a rank three seven star bishop. And dude, this, this fight is just going really well. So we're just trying to hit his block now, make him get those buffs, which are gonna build us our buffs. And also we're gonna get some MD power gain from that. So look at this, two back to ground special ones, and we have another one ready, but I don't think we're gonna throw another one. Let's see. <clears throat> yeah. Doing some intercept right here. With the relic. Bait that special two, and then we're just gonna go for our special three right here. Because we get the power gain. Special three. And let's see, dude. Let's see how fast this fight is gonna be with the special three animation. Because dude, that bishop is rank three. It's a, it's a big defender. It's actually pretty common rank three as well, so you you would see him uh, in the matches. And look at this, we're gonna pop a special two right here. Look at this damage, man. Like, it just it just destroyed him. And the thing is, Bishop has energy resistance. Look at this, 100,000 from that, that beam, man. Like, look at his health. Just got destroyed. Wow. And look at this, we had even more power gain. Like, look at that. And the energized. Like, it <laughs> there's just so much overkill. So let's see the score on that. Including a special three animation, 63 seconds, man. Like that's pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. I was really impressed with that. Uh, so here this is. Let's see what this is. I didn't. I didn't see. A Hulkling. Yeah. So it's like a very very simple fight. He's amazing for Hulkling. Obviously, he just turns Pierce into rubble. He turns indestructible into rubble. So it's pretty good, man. You get some nice charges because he's just getting buffs all the time. If they expire, they also give you some MD. Which is really, really good. You see buff destroyed. And also, when, once rubble gets... Uh, you know, w once it runs out, that gives you MD as well. Because it's a buff. So that's pretty cool. I actually like that rubble buff. And look at that, man. He just got literally destroyed. <laughs> I mean, that's a very simple fight. This was a rank 5 Hulkling. He wasn't ascended, but this was rank 5. 37 seconds. Moving on to another rank 3 defender. 345,000 Hyperion, man. This is a ton of HP to work with. And uh, we got rank 2 versus rank 3. So, yeah. Destroyer is good for him because you just made a lot of specials. And once you you know punish those specials, you gain 5 charges. So, that's pretty good. I think here we're going to try and bait that special too. But I think I'm going to do like an accidental parry. And it's going to like freak me out a little bit. But luckily he throws it after. <laughs> so, there we go. A couple of inches for slam, we're gonna throw a special one again. Yep, bait some of his specials. We got it to that knockdown. There we go. Got three furies and at this point. I just bait a couple more specials, do a few more intercepts, and I get to 100 charges. There we go. We need one more intercept or one more punish. There we go. We got the intercept SP2 massive damage. Man, his Hyperion has energy resistance too. A lot of it. Look at that. Boom. I just love that playstyle, man. Destroyer is just so sick. Look at this, man. Rank 3 Hyperion under 60 seconds. 56 seconds. Not, not bad, eh? Not bad. And now this is going to be Hercules. 
you know, rank 5 Hercules, not as ascended, but, you know, pretty simple fight. Just want to showcase that he actually can destroy the uh, immortality. There we got hit, but we had the unstoppable. That's one of the coolest things on attack for sure. It does help a ton. And also, if the opponent has a lot of buffs, which, you know, in the match against Hulkling, even if we got hit, uh, we take 25% less damage. Uh, basically, 5% for each buff. But because Hulkling always has, like, more than 5 buffs, we basically take 25% less damage from everything, which is really nice. Even, like, recoil damage, which is actually really, really uh, handy sometimes. So right here, we're gonna throw a special two. It's gonna deal massive damage. There we go. And then combo with the relic into another special two and buff destroyed. Hercules destroyed. And that was a 50 second fight or so. Yeah, 49 seconds, not bad. You can see every single fight is here around like the 50K score if everything goes right. Cause you just do a few intercepts, punish some specials and then throw two special twos or three, depends on the opponent. But yeah, this fight actually. Is actually like a really like I don't think we're gonna see Gladiator too much on defense, but he's actually good for him, really good, because he just gets buffs so uh, frequently. Like every two seconds, he gets those. Um, what's it called? Confidence, and every time he just does that, we gain two extra charges. And yeah, it's just it's really easy to just get to a hundred. Super super easy. I think I'm gonna throw a special one here, or am I not? No, I'm not going to. Okay, I'm gonna bait that special two. We got 89 charges, 91. Beta special two. Go for the punish into my special two. And look at this, like he got demolished, man. That's a rank five ascended gladiator. And look at this. We had so much more of a power gain ready. And we were close to one bar and a half. So it's dude, that's such an overheal, man. And on some champions, he just destroys them without even going for the full roll rotation. Ascended Gladiator. I think he had like 285,000. Almost 51k score right there. Now, this is actually something that I think I'm gonna do really uh, frequently with, uh, you know, with Destroyer. Because, you know, Fantman, he does get some buffs, which helps with the ramp up. But also, against Fantman, you always wanna intercept. So, you know, with Destroyer, you wanna intercept as well. So, since you're doing that, it's really nice fighting Fam. So I think I'm gonna do I'm gonna be doing this match uh, like many many times. So it, it's nice to like practice it right here on those friendlies. We unfortunately get power drain, but it doesn't matter too much. Only lost like half a bar of power. Here I'm gonna throw my special one just to get to 100 charges and refresh my furies. We have five right here. There we go. We're gonna throw one special two, so we don't push him to a special three. Want to bait his special two? There we go. And then I can just dash in. Because my, my last lasers are just going to be unblockable. Even if you block that first hit. So, yeah. Kind of surprised he didn't kill him. Maybe the armor gave him a little more armor. I don't know. But, not that big of a deal. Got a 60 second kill against an Ascended Fam. It's pretty good. Should be 50k score. Yeah, very close 50k score. And now, actually, I want to show you a match that I did on stream with Destroyer against the rank 5 Ascended Nick Fury, which I was like, yeah, maybe we should try that and see how it goes, because he is bleed immune. You know, if, if something happens, I'm not going to take too much damage. Also, he has some buffs. He just got, like, some Furies that we can work with. But, uh, yeah, this match isn't going to be, like, perfect. But this was li literally, like, the first time I tried Destroyer against Nick Fury. And I'm going to be doing that matchup for sure a lot more. Because I think he's actually pretty safe. He's just bleed immune. Sa same thing like Shala, where he can block and block. She can block and blockables, and it is safe from bleed. Destroyer is safe from the bleed as well. So that was a nice line intercept by the AI. We love to see that. But thankfully, the unstoppable just saves you sometimes. Because those things tend to happen for sure with AI these days. We also have the ra rank three juggernaut relic, which helps us with the region a lot. I really love that relic. That's why I took it to rank three. Plus, it's made for Destroyer pretty much. Destroyer and Juggernaut. Both champions are amazing. But yeah, here we are going to bait that special two. And once we go in, we're going to get to 100 charges. Get our power gain. You can see that nice regeneration right here. Throw our first special two. It almost is enough to kill a man. And then I, I here, I actually wanted to throw an SP1. Because I didn't want to waste too much of my power. And as you can see, he has his LMD now. Or sorry, that his LMD is destroyed. Pop another specialty that we had ready, and he's half health. 
That's that's honestly that's a, that's pretty decent so far. And right here, I think I'm gonna combo with my relic. It should be available. No, it's not. But we go for the risky intercept, but it wasn't that risky because we had the unstoppable. And as you can see, we didn't even get to throw our last special, so he just died. Like, um, Destroyer, look at this, 47,000 score for Nick Fury, not bad. But yeah, Destroyer, the thing about Destroyer is that once he gets his Furies, which is actually not, not that bad to get, it's pretty easy. He does hit really hard, like even with his basic attacks, you can see those like 10k medium attack crits, and then you just have that massive special too. So yeah, man, there's going to be even more destroy gameplay on my streams, guys. But I just wanted to do a few matches in BGs and some matches that I think it would be cool. But I couldn't showcase like a lot of different options because I just didn't have too many defenders on my free to play account. But that's why we're going to be using him in BGs every single time and just pick him every time I see him. So yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.